What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma and before we get started I want to thank Create My Intro for that awesome, awesome intro. You can check him out down in the description below. Check it out on Twitter. The man does amazing work. So here we are, still ranked number seven. In the previous video we, um, we had a match against Kevin Owens at Fastlane. It did not seem to matter. Kevin Owens goes down. Uh, we're facing off against Cesaro right now. We beat Tyler Reed in a SmackDown match that I thought I was recording, and I didn't. I don't know who Mike West is, and Baron Blade is all over the rankings. I don't like it. I mean, look at him. There he is. There he is. There he is. There he is. I do like to see The Undertaker as the number one contender, though. That is very cool to me. And then there's just this list, minus Baron Blade, of course. You have Daniel Bryan, who is the United States champion. He won that uh, from Seth Rollins at the, the Fastlane pay-per-view. Um, Finn Balor lost, the demon Finn Balor, lost against Dean Ambrose, so he retained the Intercontinental Championship. But I like this list. The Rock is on there. Bray Wyatt, even Big E, John Cena, Triple H, Roman Reigns. It's a decent list for the World Heavyweight Championship, but we are in this Intercontinental Championship thing. We've beaten Dolph to a pulp. Every fight we've had against Kevin Owens, we won. We're about to beat Cesaro. We've beaten Tyler Reed. I don't know what we need to do to move up. And people have said that you have to get into a rivalry, ri excuse me, rivalry with someone higher than you. And we've done that in Kevin Owens, but now he's way below us. So, looking at the card here, we got Daniel Bryan and Dean Ambrose. We have the United States Champion versus the Intercontinental Champion. That's a decent match. Why is it opening the show again? I'm not sure. So, we don't see anything with Kevin Owens. What? Why? Okay, and and look, and these fools, I don't know. Let's get into the matchup, though. We're going to take on Cesaro, and leave a big thumbs up. Like the video if you like Puma's mask. It's a mask on top of a mask. It looks freaking awesome. But yeah, let's get into our matchup here with Cesaro. So here's the card. Let's simulate through this. The Intercontinental Champion Dean Ambrose beats the United States Champion Daniel Bryan. The New Day beat Big Cass and Enzo, of course. Undertaker defeats Kane. John Cena defeats Neville. Triple H defeats Sheamus. How are we not surprised by all of this? And now we have our matchup. CM Puma versus Cesaro. Look at this. Kevin Owens, you son of a bee. I can't break out. And oh, he catches this with a clothesline. What's he doing here? Uh, nothing? Get punched. Get punched. Put me down. Here on the stage, look at this. Face first into the stage. Oh boy. You know for sure. You're not going to get, get kicked in the face. We didn't even take off our jacket yet. And look, big pile driver to Kevin Owens right there on the stage. Get, no, I'm not going to let you. What are you doing, Puma? Kick him. Jeez. Uh-oh. Owens tosses us down, and we don't even make it down the ramp. Oh my gosh. Huge kick to the face. But we're going to get him in that gut. And oh, Owens now with a shot to the stomach. Not today, fool. Look at this. Back of the head. Onto the ramp. Dear God. Dear God, what is going on? These kids love the destruction. So we take off, apparently we take off our jacket just long enough to uh, 
attack Kevin Owens. Flatliner on the outside. And vaulting over the top. My gosh. Puma picks him up, and he's just going right for it. Look at this. Oh, my God. What a backstabber that was. What a backstabber that was. And you know what? We're going to hit him with our finisher. Yes, we are. But we are. We're going to get him on a little bit of the metal. Get up. Man, I... Oh, God. He just got his face stomped on. Puma is fired up. And he he, he wants to hit Cage... Uh, I almost said Cage. Kevin Owens with this. But he's got to bring his funky tail up the ramp. Oh! Jeez. This could end up badly on the ramp. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Please don't. Suplex on the ramp. Or on the stage, rather. My gosh, I thought... I thought Owens was going to throw him off the damn stage. Well, that was pretty crazy. And we kind of goof goofed it up a little bit we should have taken him out when we had the chance i wanted to do some more damage and ko took advantage mike west defeats tyler reed let's head it on over to smackdown so here we are on smackdown we finally get a match against ko and uh geez we're opening the show again fatal four-way battle royal this is uh Pretty much a battle royal of the big men minus Triple H. I mean, Triple H is big, but not like Henry Corbin or Big Show. We just got some nobodies here. B-Blade taking on Daniel Bryan. Again, Undertaker versus Kane. Randy Orton versus Rusev. Seth Rollins versus The Rock. Can you imagine? And geez, Brock Lesnar versus AJ Styles. Let's get into SmackDown and our match with KO. Boy, he looks pissed off. Can we? I'm not sure if we can break out. All right, let's just get into the fight because I know Puma is pissed off. He didn't get a chance to do the damage he wanted to to Kevin Owens. But, boy, we're going to get it done tonight. Oh, jeez. And nice reversal. Puma immediately going and going after him. Look at that, the whipper snapper. Very nice. Puma jumping on to the outside here. And he drop kicks KO right to the face. And hooks him up now for that spinning neck breaker. We really took advantage of old KO. Nice move there. A little swanton from the outside in. Puma now just following it up a second swanton. And Puma's told him once. He's told him a thousand times. Oh! Puma's ears get clapped. And, oh, he KO stomps the face. Even though he's wearing that mask, it is not forgiving. Oh! Shoot. Gut buster. Across the knee. Followed up by the Sinton. Nice move there by KO. Puma cannot get seem to get away. Oh. No. Puma kicks out. He's not going down that easy. Stops him. Very nice. Into a whip, and now he's just got the double fists. Come on now. So, we, in an effort to get moved up the list and get more fans and all that good stuff, we have uh, acquired some new moves. But it looks like we're going to have to do a little bit of damage to KO. Okay. Oh, geez. Can we? do? We're going to roll out. And they both just taunt each other. Knee to the face. Very nice. 
get up. And Puma's going to toss KO back into the ring. Going up top now. Climbing up. He had that option for the signature. We do have a top rope signature. But, you know, I'm just... I, I don't want to do it if he's just facing... Or, or I don't want to do it if he's on his back. He's got to be laying face up. Here we go. Imploding 450. Not the signature, but very awesome nonetheless. And, man, Puma cannot get that. Oh, oh. What a rollover. Very nice. We're going to jump out again just, just because we can. Come on, KO. And a diving blockbuster from Puma. Man, this high flyer. Oh, went for a frog splash. And KO dove out of the way. He kind of wiggled out of the way. Knee to the gut now. And here we go. One of my favorite moves in this game. Oh, he reversed it. Oh, and he... Oh, jeez. He did that the last time. Puma's neck bouncing off the ropes. No. Not today. Hooking the leg up. German into the corner. German suplex into the corner. Here we go. With that new signature. Red arrow. It is the red arrow. And now... We charge it up. We're charging that junk. Puma picking Owens up. Look at this. Oh, and he drops him on his head. Not done yet, though. It does not look that way. Puma picks up KO. Shot to the stomach. No. KO moves. Look at this. Oh, man. Big Samoan drop from Kevin Owens. Puma able to move. Reversal from KO. Oh, man. And a knee across the back of the head of Puma. Uh-oh. Are we about to see? Oh, we're about to see the pop-up. And there it is. There it is. The nemesis of Puma's... NXT career and KO gets another one. Oh my gosh. KO gets the victory over Puma. Not how we want to do this. And not how we move up, that's for sure. Well. A loss is not how we move up. That We know that. That's for sure. And that just sucks. So let's see. Triple H. Oh, God. The game. Uh, winning over all these big men. Brody Tyson wins there. What? What? Come on. Undertaker defeats Kane again. Orton defeats Rusev. Seth Rollins defeats The Rock. And, of course, Brock Lesnar defeats AJ Styles. So let's head in to Raw. See what's in store for CM Puma and Kevin Owens. Well, it looks like we are facing off against KO once again, but look at this. We have negative seven points. What did I do to Callisto? And this guy. Man, these guys are super pissed at me. Whew. We are down. We're Well, we're up in wins, two to one, but we are down seven rivalry points. Oof, we got to catch up. And man, the shirts. I like that shirt. I like the way it's set up now. So I'm not going to bother with that. KO, though, moves up to number five. Maverick, for, what? Moves up to number two. Baron Blade on every friggin' list there is. Dang, Mojo with that NXT shot, maybe. Seth Rollins moves up above The Undertaker. 
for that shot at the WWE Heavyweight Championship. But Baron Blade is now number one contender, followed by Maverick, Balor, Bryan, and KO. Now, we've got to get some wins over KO. That's for sure. He's number five. That's what we got to do. So, um, that is going to be it for this episode. We will not be using a foreign object in our match. Let's take a look at the card real quick. There we go. That's what I like to see. Main event stuff. All right. A normal fatal four-way. D. Bry, who is the United States champion. Dean Ambrose, who is the Intercontinental champion. Baron Blade and The Miz. Weird. Jane Jett and Jack Swagger. Alex Hart and Lance Xander. Del Rio versus Neville. Ryder versus Henry. This is like Job Central. Rollins versus Stardust. Okay. Triple H versus a very sassy mother. She is not happy with the discount she received. It was not enough at Dress Barn. Triple H taking on the mother of a troubled youth. And then our match, Steam Puma, taking on Kevin Owens in the main event of Raw. That's going to be in the next video. Uh, we've got some SWF coming soon, guys. we got the new arena, the Rebellion Arena. We have our new champion in Rick Andrews. It's it's on its way, I promise. It takes a little longer to set up than one of these matches, uh, one of these videos, but it will get done, I promise. So, thank you guys for watching. Come back. We have another main event matchup with Kevin Owens.